Okay, it's pop break time. Adele makes a rare public appearance alongside a Cleveland A-lister. Bridgerton's second season is put on pause, and Britney Spears is setting the record straight again about future performances. Here's Kiera Cotton with all the details. And the Britney Spears conservatorship drama continues. The 39-year-old singer most recently posted to Instagram that she's not going to be performing on any stages anytime soon, especially with her dad handling what she wears, says, does, and thinks. But she's still singing and dancing from the comfort of her home and with those she loves. Her boyfriend Sam shared a video over the weekend of the pop star singing her hit song, Lonely, as they're driving in a car. And it appears the upcoming social season will just have to wait. Filming for season two of Netflix's Bridgerton has been halted indefinitely after two people tested positive for COVID-19. The decision to halt production comes after a 24-hour pause last week when the first case was confirmed on set. While the first case was a crew member, it's unknown whether the second is an actor or a crew member. But due to the indefinite nature, many speculate that it may be an actor. The UK, where the romance show is being filmed, is currently experiencing a surge in infections due to the highly contagious Delta variant. And we're rolling in the deep about this next story. Singer Adele was spotted during a rare public appearance at the NBA Finals game on Saturday. And the sultry songstress wasn't alone. She was spotted courtside with Cleveland native and agent to some of the best players in the game, Rich Paul. And rumor has it, according to multiple outlets, the two are in fact dating. News of Adele's new potential romance comes just four months after finalizing her divorce from Simon Konecki. Now, for me personally, it doesn't matter who she's dating. She looks great, and she appears to be happy, and quite frankly, that's all that matters. But in true consumer fashion, I would be remiss if I wasn't anticipating new music. <laughs> I need to hear the sadness. I need to hear all that she's been through. Well, I'm wonder... sure she's working on that in the background, yep. or at least let's hope, right? Yeah. But I thought it was kind of cool this year with Rich Paul. I was like, oh, look at us. We I know him. Yeah, <laughs> he's, he's a familiar face. And then, you know, the whole thing becomes what's her music going to become? Right. Because it was yeah. all that gut-wrenching emotion. The you know, rage, just right? Right there. And is it now going to turn and be happy and pop again? I, I mean, don't think so. We've do? got six years to still get through, guys, of everything that she's been going through. I'm just going to, fingers crossed, we can still do this. There's a lot to unpack still. Right, yeah, right. Saying. Okay, good material. She can tap into that. Definitely. <laughs>